to find the greatest common factor of two monomials, we will first look for the greatest common factor of the coefficients. 4 is 2 times 2 and 6 is 2 times 3. The largest number that is a factor of both is 2. So the numerical GCF is 2. Now x cubed is x times x three times and x to the fifth is x times x five times. The lesser of the exponent is x cube and x cube is the GCF. So the GCF is 2x cubed. 9 is 3 times 3. 3 is just 3. The numerical GCF, largest number that 9 and 3 share is 3. Now, automatically the lesser exponent is the GCF so it's y to the fourth number three between 16 and 24 16 is 4 times 4 which is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 4 times and 24 is 8 times 3, so it's 2 times 2 times 2 times 3. The numerical GCF is 8. So the GCF is 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. For the variable, we'll take the lesser of the exponent. This one is 8 to the first, which is A. And the other one is b to the second. The GCF is 8ab squared. For number 4, numerical GCF, 25 is 5 times 5. 15 is 3 times 5. The numerical GCF is 5. A squared is by itself, so we'll skip A squared. B to the 5th and B to the 6th. B to the 5th is the common factor. For number 5, we have 7, which is only 7. 7 is prime. 12 is 2 times 2 times 3. They don't share anything, so the GCF is 1. x cubed x to the 8th. x cubed is the lower number. And y to the 6 is by itself. So the GCF is x cubed. Between 12, 9 and 21. 12 is 2 times 2 times 3. 9 is 3 times 3. 21 is 3 times times 7. So the GCF, which is the largest number that they share as a factor, is 3. Now, x to the 5th, x to the 7th, and x to the 2nd, x to the 2nd is the lowest number. 